What's good, guys? Prince Sports here. So let's get into it. Now, recently, Draymond Green was talking to LeBron James, and he was boasting and bragging with LeBron, like, hey, man, I was on the phone with dude, and, man, it feels good to have four, and, you know, I'm sitting at the same table with you, just stuff like that, okay? Boasting and bragging. Like, you deserve to be at the same table with LeBron James. Dog, you're not a superstar. You're not an all-star. You're not elite at anything, okay? So, where do you get off acting like you this great basketball player that puts people above that over and above the edge? No, you don't. You don't even help your team win on the biggest stage there is. Because, if anything, you cost the Golden State Warriors two championships. 2016, we all know how that came out with you. All right? You wet the bed in that one. And then in 2019, you had the chance to still prove yourself with Steph Curry. And both of y'all failed. All right? And you didn't do much anything in 2019 but got cooked by Pascal Siakam. Duh. Okay, so miss me with that, man. Dog, you are a role player, an average basketball player. To be an all-star, you got to be great at something. To be a superstar, you got to be elite at something. You don't fit that bill on no aspect. You're not an elite defender. You're not a, an elite scorer. You average a triple single, so we're going to leave off that. Okay? But there is nothing that you do. That is great. You're just an average basketball player. And then there's some people that tell, that get the nerve to say Draymond Green is the greatest role player of all time. Okay, so you went capping for him by saying he's an all-star. But then when you realize he's not an all-star, you move the goalposts and say he's the greatest role player. Listen, you idiots. We don't judge role players. Okay, because they're too average. That's like me looking at a store brand chocolate chip cookie and say, this is the greatest store brand chocolate chip cookie of all time. It's too much to rate. There's nothing elite. There's nothing rare about it. Okay. What next? You're going to rate trees out of all the millions of trees you see outside. This is the greatest tree of all time. <laughs> it don't go that way, man. Okay. Anything's average that's right there in the middle cannot be rated too much because there's nothing that's special about it. We rate superstars because they're special. Okay, they stand out. They do something elite. Something that you don't do, Draymond Green. You're not elite. Okay? <laughs> In fact, you cost your team more than help them win. It's easy to ride the back of the bus and ride the shotgun of three of the greatest shooters of all time. You won with superstars on your team. Not because of you. You didn't do nothing to move the needle. All you did was piggyback off your teammates. You're not even the best defender on your team because you cannot guard perimeter basketball players in 2022 when the game is dedicated to perimeter players that score and move without the ball, shoot threes, shoot perimeter mid-range jump shots, and attack the basket. You cannot do none of that. The only guys you play good defense on is slow-footed, non-athletic, bigs who don't fit in this era that much anyway because the game is a little too fast paced and the five position is pretty much dead and nobody talks about it anymore this is why you at six seven plays the five position because the nba went away with the five position for the most part but don't make no mistake about it elite fives will cook you because you don't have enough to guard them hakeem olajuwon david robinson will cook you period all right this year Andrew Wiggins was the guy who would should have been second voted MVP outside of Steph Curry. It wasn't you, you idiot. You didn't do nothing big. You didn't do nothing devastating in this series at all on the biggest stage there is. And you never did. The best series you played in is 2016, the series that you choked in. You had three opportunities to close LeBron out, but you can't guard him. But guess who could guard LeBron James? Iguodala. He saved the Golden State Warriors in 2015. Not even Steph Curry. Because if it wasn't for Iguodala guarding LeBron James, uh, the Cleveland Cavaliers probably went up three games to one. They had a chance to do that in their own home arena. But the fact that Iggy was putting it on LeBron and LeBron said, hey, this guy made me tired. He made me work hard. You didn't do that, Draymond Green. You didn't have no effect on stopping LeBron James. You didn't have no effect on stopping nobody elite. Okay? Dennis Rodman, Ron Artest, Kevin Garnett. Hakeem Olajuwon, David Robinson, Gary Payton, Scottie Pippen, Michael Jordan. Um, the list goes on and on. You're not even better than Patrick Beverly. 
Patrick Beverly is a better one-on-one -on -one defender than you because he gets in people's guts and he could guard perimeter basketball players. Something you don't do. Okay? You're a role player, my man. And miss me with that greatest role player stuff because that don't exist. If you're the greatest role player, then what does that make Robert Ory? He got more championships than you. He rode the bus better than you. Okay? He rode the back of the bus and better than you, dog. You ain't that. You don't help people win championships. You may help every now and then in some games. You had your moments. But you don't pit nobody over the top. You ain't no main reason why the Golden State Warriors won championships. Never. They won two with Kevin Durant and Steph Curry and Klay Thompson. Star power won two championships. Period. 2015, I just explained Iguodala, then Steph Curry, not you. This year, Andrew Wiggins, Steph Curry, Klay Thompson third, and you somewhere floating around with the Jordan Pools and all of that stuff. Jordan Poole played better than you for the most part throughout this playoff run. I'm out, man. You're a role player. Stop acting like you're elite. You don't deserve to sit at no table. You're an average basketball player. Mr. Triple Single, I'm out.